Welcome to the sixth lesson of quadratic expressions and equation. In this lesson, we are going to learn how to draw quadratic graphs of quadratic functions. Uh, so we are given when y is equals to x squared, y is said to be a function of x. So let's take an example and see how we draw the graph of a quadratic function. So example one, write the graph of y is equals to x squared minus 4x plus 4 for the range minus 3 less than or equals to x less than or equals to 5. So for us to be able to draw this uh, graph of y is equals to x squared minus 4x plus 4, we need a table like the one that I have here. So in this column, we will put the terms of uh, x. So here we have our x. Here we have x squared. Here we have minus 4x. And here we have 4. And here we have y. So we have obtained this from our function here, x squared minus 4x plus 4. Then uh, from our range which we have given, we are told x ranges from minus 3 to 5. So we will put our values of x here. So we will start with minus 3. Uh, we go to minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So that is the range. So in this row where we have x squared, we need to identify x squared. So minus 3 uh, minus 3 squared is 9. Minus 2 squared is 4. Uh, minus 1 squared is 1. 0 squared is 1. 1 squared is 1. 2 squared is 4. 3 squared is 9. 4 squared is 16 and 5 squared is 25. From there we have minus 4x, so it means we multiply minus 4 with uh, the value of x which is 3, so minus 3, minus 4 times minus 3, you will get positive 12. Minus 4 times minus 2, you will get positive 8. Minus 4 times minus 1, you get positive 4. Then minus 4 times 0, you get 0. Minus 4 times 1, you get minus 4. Uh, you, minus 4 times 2, you get minus 8. Uh, then we have minus 4 times 3, you get minus 12. Uh, we have minus 4 times 4, you get minus 16. Uh, then we have minus 4 times 5, you get minus 20. Uh, 4 is a constant here, so we just write 4 uh, throughout that row. So we have 4, another 4, 4, 4. So having those values, we now have the value of y. So here, since we have been given x squared minus 4x plus 4, we say 9. So this is x squared minus 4x plus 4. So this is 9 plus 12 is 21 plus 4, we get 25. Then we have uh, 4 plus 8 is 12. 12 plus 4, we get 16. Uh, then we have 1 plus 4 is 5. 5 plus 4 is 9. Uh, 0 plus 0 is 0. Plus 4 is 4. Uh, this is 1 minus 4 is minus 3. Minus 3 plus 4, we get positive 1. Here is 4 minus 8 is minus 4. Uh, minus 4 plus 4 we get 0. 
uh, then we have 9 plus minus 12 is minus 3 minus 3 plus 4 we get positive 1 uh, here we have 16 minus 16 is 0 0 plus 4 we get 4 uh, then we have 25 minus 20 is min is 5 5 plus 4 we get 9 so what this means is that when x is minus 3 y is 25 when x is minus 2 y is 16 when x is minus 1 y is 9 on and on up to when x is 5 y is 9 so these are the values that we are going to plot on a graph paper uh, so that we will be able to get the graph represented by this function so before we plot the graph we need to identify the lowest value of x is minus 3 lowest value of x is minus 3 and the highest value of x is 5 the lowest value of y is 0 and the highest value of y is uh, 25 so this will guide us in plotting our Cartesian plane so that we know how high is our value of y and how far horizontally is the value of x so this is our graph paper we have the grid uh, we have the table that we have discussed in a, uh, there before so we have the values of x and the values of y so the first thing is to draw the x y axis so this will be our starting point so we say that the value of x the lowest is minus 3 and the highest is minus is 5 so we have 1 we have 2 3 4 and 5 so that is our x axis uh, on the negative side we have minus 1 we have minus 2 we have minus 3 uh, this is 0 so why because the the, the the highest value the scale is we use a smaller scale so here from 0 we say this is 5 uh, this is 10 this is 15 uh, this is 20 and this is 25 so that is our x axis uh, we read the values from the table so that we are able to identify uh, the, vari uh, the various uh, uh, points so when x is minus 3 y is 25 so we come here my y x is minus 3 we go up up to where we have y is 25 we put a, a mark when x is 2 uh, y is 16 minus 2 so minus 2 uh, uh, the scale of y this is our y uh, two small squares are representing one so 16 is there uh, when x is minus 1 y is 9 so this is minus 1 9 will be there uh, when x is 0 y is 4 so 0 we have y is 4 uh, when x is uh, 1 y is 1 so we have that is our 1 when x is 2 y is 0 so that is our y when x is 3 y is 1 so we have 1 there when x is 4 y is 4 so that is our value of 4 uh, then when x is 5 y is 9 so y, y is 9 that is where our, our y is so from there uh, having identified the various point of x and y then you use uh, you draw a line touching all these points 
and you use uh, your free hand you don't use arura so let's draw uh, the fine